Virtual Office makes it easy to access and set up your voicemail. Before you get started, you need to set up your password and voicemail greeting. In some cases, your system administrator might set up a default password for you. We'll show you how to change your password or set one up for the first time. To access your voicemail settings, press the settings icon. Select voicemail. This will automatically take you to your voicemail settings. Here, you can change your greetings, notifications, voicemail password, and more. First, let's set your voicemail password referred to here as a PIN. To set a new PIN, click Reset Access PIN. Here, type in your new PIN and retype to verify. Click Save to set your new PIN. Now, let's take a look at your greeting settings. Your external voicemail greeting is the greeting that is played to any caller outside the company. To set this, click Change. Here, you can have audio professionally recorded through the Audio Production Store. Click on Create Audio Files to upload your own file or call a phone number to record your greeting. When you upload your own audio file, give your file a name, such as General Greeting. This way, you can find the audio file easily later. Click Save. When you click Call a Phone Number to record, begin by giving the audio a name. Type in your extension or phone number and press Call Now. The system will call you and prompt you to press 1 before recording your voicemail message. When you're finished, press pound and follow the prompts to finish uploading your new recording. Voicemail name and last name lets you record your first and last name to be used for the default voicemail greeting. Callers will hear an automated message followed by your recording. Internal voicemail greeting is the greeting that will be played for any caller from inside your company. You can change these two greetings the same way we changed external voicemail greeting. Now, let's take a look at notifications. If you would like to receive an email notification when you have a voicemail, you can select that preference here. To change your settings, use the drop-down menu. When you're finished, click Save. To retrieve your voicemail, select the Calls tab, then select Voicemails. Here, you will be able to play your voicemails, call the caller back, delete the message, and more. To play a voicemail, click on the voicemail and press the play button.